Yeah, I copy. You're just fine. You're 5'9 plus 20. Yeah, you're 5'9 plus 40, yeah. Huh? Yeah, that's, that that's must be some mistake. You need to check your metering. It needs to recalibrate, over. Well, it's not no problem the last time I checked, over. <laughs> okay, so it looks like you're using your portable antenna for 20. Uh, it looks like you're going to have to change out the traps for the 40 meter version, over. Yeah, for the 40 meter version, I need to put uh, a brace on the top, put a center pole and uh, run two wires. Uh, because it'll be sagging a little too much, huh? Yeah, okay, QSL, give me a nice long transmission in the next go around. Let me know how you're doing over there in St. Lucia and how you're making out with the uh, lap down and uh, what's been happening. What's the latest in St. Lucia, over? Okay, no problem. 9 Zulu for Yankee J69 Zulu. Yeah, we're on the lockdown uh, mode there. Not fully locked down. We have opened up a little bit. So we are locked down from 7 p.m. to 5 a.m. And uh, we can move around all day, but uh, not going to the beach. Uh, not loitering in the area. Just to go to the supermarket. Go to the bank. Go to the gas station. And uh, go to the pharmacy and back home. But all in all, we're not complaining. We have extended our uh, lockdown for the next two weeks and uh, see how that goes and uh, we're using the, uh, the antenna this afternoon in the uh, horizontal position horizontal dipole this afternoon just about uh, 15 feet and uh, we're running the uh, Alenco DX Sierra Radio in line Zulu 4 Yankee with a 40 over 9 signal here on the island of St. Lucia J69 Zulu uh oh Okay, QSL J69 Zulu 934Y returning OK and Cletus, thank you for that. And uh, looks like things are shaping up quite a bit though. We're not exactly on lockdown here in Trinidad anyway, and uh, but we do have some restrictive movements here and there. We do have some individuals want to do their own thing and uh, not adhering to the advice from the Ministry of Health and all that stuff. So <laughs> hopefully the actions of a minority would not affect the majority. But uh, we're going to be hunkered down until April 30th. But I do believe that date is going to change in the next couple of weeks. <laughs> and uh, we're going to be inside until uh, 2021. I've been saying that the last two weeks now, over. Yeah, and a lot of people want to believe you. And uh, that's what 2020 brought. Uh, not too much of a good vision. <laughs> yeah, 2020 vision is working. 2020 man, they have us locked down and I heard somebody say oh oh and I, got, uh, I think it's chain 69 bravo bravo Roseman on frequency first them are gone okay yeah I love the pause you're hoping that somebody will give come up in there and give a call sign so anyway yeah well 2020 didn't start off too well either so uh, Definitely, uh, this is going to be the year that everybody really remembers. And uh, I've seen some posts on social media that history repeats itself. Is it every 20 years, something like that? I can't remember. Uh, we had the outbreak of cholera, we had the Black Death disease, and all sorts of different things. And so in 2020, it looks like we have uh, COVID-19. So definitely history is repeating itself. J69Z. 9Z4Y, over. No problem. Yes, 6 Bravo, Bravo. Uh, we have 9Z4 uh, Yankee, J69 Zulu. One up with Good afternoon. Yeah, very good. Uh, J69Z, 9Y4 Yankee. Okay, oh, I guess, 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 I
Well, Mark, I tell you, when you have a disability like mine, man, hiding is a natural thing, you know. Your whole life is a hiding thing. Everything you do, everything you say, everything you receive, everything you're part of is hiding, you know. It's like this with a disability. I remember one time where we were complaining to the government and we had to say that they treat us like uh, we are in, we are transparent. You know what I'm talking about? <laughs> but Mark, I'm there, I'm there battling, man. I'm there fighting, really fighting, man. I have a hip, I have a hip problem. I had a surgery one year ago and it's... It is not doing very well, so I mean, I appreciate the pain and some of the challenges too. I may be checking into the hospital anytime, anytime. But I'm fighting. It's good to have you, Mark. You sound great, eh, man. Five nine plus. I can't remember when last I heard a Trinidadian station on 20 meters so loud, Mark. What are you doing over there? Running a, a 50 element beam or something? Nine Y four Y at the group 90. That's why I don't want to kill it. Yeah, do nothing, Mark. <laughs> Uh, Roseman, I'm just trying to do the best that I can with the junk that I got. I keep on saying that, nobody wants to believe me. <laughs> I'm just running us a little hex beam here, and that's about it, you know. So anyway, nice, I do, uh, one of the other things that I do have in my side, I just started dating Mother Nature, so uh, definitely that's the perks in there. But anyway, Roseman, it doesn't make me smile to know that you're in pain and you're not having a good time over there in St. Lucia. I know Ernest is your good buddy. Last time I was talking to him on the phone, we talked for maybe about an hour or so, and he did mention that you did call and you was going to come over. So anyway, it doesn't make me feel happy to know that you're in such pain and uncomfortable and not doing so well. But at least you can find the time to get on the radio and still smile and laugh about it, over. Oh, indeed, Mark. Boy, I tell you, thank God for my radio. I think I discovered the right hobby, man. From boxing, which was my favorite hobby, after I fought all over the world for many years. And I chose, uh, well, at that same time, I had this hobby already. I almost was in and out of it. And I said, boy, let me, let me let go get more serious with this hobby. But I tell you, this hobby is beautiful, man. Social distancing. We don't need that, Mark. Look at the three of us. Look at how close we are together. We're not bothered, Mark. How are you, huh? 